especially coming from a, a melee, um, you know, from high dexterity, and especially, you know, from Mewtwo King, you know, just his history of playing melee, right, and of course. course not being able to perform fully at 100%. Um, earlier, I think Cloud is such a perfect character for that, because you don't have to put too much into him, right. but you still have to get those reads in, you still have to get those frames and all that stuff. No what moves to do and something and I find too is that Cloud is a very very good character at punishing habits and punishing yes he is poor landings and he is. with a, a, a player like Mewtwo King he'll be able to make some really really hard punishes and of course that uh oh wow wow off to a really good start already a good start already racking up 58 percent we'll be seeing a lot of air dodge baits with the top airs and I think that he'll be trying to bait a lot of people to try to punish his down air as well. Oh, yes. And using how good that move is. And he's having... Mitsu King is putting up a lot of pressure against Sonic off stage. An immense amount of pressure. And and the thing is, is that Mitsu King wants Sonic to be off stage. And right. this is what we're seeing here. He wants him to be off stage. Well, if he gives Sonic any time to get his space and start playing the defensive game... It's over. Yeah, yeah that's it, Sonic for you. It's over. So now with the percent lead, Mewtwo King's gonna wait for him to try and make a bad option. Wow. Ooh, that was a definitely difficult situation right there. M Mewtwo King literally covered all of those options right there. And the, the feeling of laying on that ground, just seeing Mewtwo King glowing blue, and you're like, okay. <laughs> what am I gonna what do? Can I do? <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what happened there. Um, but thankfully, Sonic was able to recover perfectly fine. Look for the grab, back throw, and he's gonna do a finisher. No, not yet. And the thing with Mewtwo King's limit break, it's so difficult to know when he's gonna use it because yeah, he, he'll he get saves that, he'll hang it on so it much. Forever. He will have it forever and take it out when he least expects it. Something that I love watching uh, Clouds do, especially high level Clouds, is the ledge trump with the limit side B. Oh, yes. He so early. So early. I don't know if it's actually confirmed or if that's. Purely just reaction based, but I mean, with how the move is probably e e e executed, it probably is confirmed. I'm not sure. Fast move. It is pretty fast, yeah. Goes for that dash attack. Is it, um, he's not even giving him a second to breathe. He's at not. All. He has that. He's, he's doing an amazing job with that ledge, that ledge guard. All right, so this is the time that King Will... Oh my god, he scared me for a second. He was really banking on Mewtwo King making it very He recovery. was, yeah. But this is not Mewtwo King's first rodeo. It seemed that Mewtwo King was waiting to see what Sonic was going to do. And to see what he could follow up with. But I think Sonic didn't want to take any chances. Right, that should be it. There it goes. So first game going to Mewtwo King. Definitely. Yeah, Where that matchup? Exactly how we need to play. Exactly. That. Yes. Not and letting him have a second of breathe. Just playing complete rush down. Yeah, no breathing room. He definitely made sure that you know he's like, hey, I'm gonna keep you off the stage. I'm not gonna give you a chance to do any spin dashes on me. Nothing. You're you're gonna be off stage. I'm gonna try to ledge guard you as much as possible. Right. And it went into his favor. And there was a lot of patient play from both players. But I think Sonic was just put in a lot of pressure situations. Definitely. Oh, oh, he's switching up to Switch Mario. Up. And I think Mario can handle Cloud a, a little bit better, only because of his combo okay. of, of potential. So he could definitely rack up some damage on Cloud, but I'm not too sure. Um, I mean, it's Mewtwo King's Cloud, so I'm not too sure how right, uh, I mean, that's going to work out. I've never seen Will play Mario before, or Soul Bad Guy play Mario before, but uh, I'm excited to see why he chose this instead of going his primary character. Now, of course, here we are going to see those automatic combos. Guarantees. We'll see here. Because, yeah, a very low percentage Cloud can get clipped in by Mario's up tilt very easily, but... Mewtwo King seems to know the matchup, <laughs> as we're seeing here. And those down airs have absolutely no landing match. They're very, very um, deceiving. Yes, and that ledge guard, oh my god. 
And Mita King, earlier he was doing a lot of jabs, just snuffing out Mario with a lot of his options, and he takes the stock with that forward air. You can tell that Mita King just knows exactly this what Will's yeah. gonna do, too. Will's gonna have to switch it up a bit. Um, I mean, probably maybe grab more, shield a lot more. Um, I'm not seeing a lot of shields from um, Soul Bad Guy. And I think that's what he needs. I, I, I think he just needs... Wow. I think that was probably a hard read on that upbeat. Yeah. Must have been uh, expecting him to rush in. Go for that forward smash. Yeah. And there it is. And I think what happened there, I think so, so Bad Guy was just so pressured in um, that I think that's what that's what happened. Okay. I mean, that makes sense. Granted, Mewtwo King is obviously a very, very good player. Yeah. So. <laughs> I 